Hello and welcome to the Capture the Flag video series. In this video, we will look at solving questions from the Magnet Virtual Summit 2021 Capture the Flag contest. Please help me out by hitting the subscribe button so it can be free to grow my beard. If you want to follow along, see the links in the description section below for the link to the MVS 2021 CTF event where you can register. Then you will get an email with the links to download the images. There should be four images in total, a Chromebook image, a Google Takeout data set, a Mac OS image, and a iOS file system image. In this video, we will focus on the Google Takeout data set and answer the related questions. Because I love Linux, I will be using nothing but the Kane Linux Forensics distro and the internet to answer the Google Takeout related questions. The first thing you'll need to do is to unzip the downloaded file. Once we have the takeout.zip broken out, let's cd into the folder and take a look at what we have. I'm going to do backslash ls-l. I'm going to use the backslash before the ls so that the system can use the unaliased version of the ls command. The default ls command has colors, which makes it hard for you to see in the video. So that's why I'm going to do the non-colored version. Question one, you've got mail. How many emails were received from notification at service.tiktok.com? I'm going to CD into the mail folder to see what's in there. So CD mail, I'm going to do an LS. There is only one file here and it has the .mbox extension. So it's a mailbox formatted file. Let's use the grep command to find the lines with the keyword of notification at service.tiktok.com. So I'm going to type grep, single quote, notification at service, backslash dot, tiktok, backslash dot, com, and then ending the single quote. And now I'm going to hit all and hit the tab for tab complete. And it looks like there are a number of lines that match what we're looking for. Let's narrow down the search by only matching lines that start with the word from. So I'm going to up arrow and then add the caret, which means the beginning of the line, and then the word capital F R O M, and then the dot star to signify anything in between the word from and notification. And then the rest of it, I'm going to leave the same. So once I hit return, this gives us the answer we need because the only thing that's remaining is all the lines that says from, and then it has the notification at service.tiktok.com. In this case, we, we can definitely count the number of lines. But if there are too many lines to count, we can use the word count command to do that for us. So I'm going to up arrow. And then at the end, I'm going to add the pipe to WC space dash L and then hit return. And so this returns with just a count with a number of lines. Question two, hungry for direction. Where did the user request directions to on March 4th, 2021 at 4 15, 18 a.m. Eastern Daylight Time? I'm going to use the Firefox browser to help us on this one. If I traverse down the file path to my activity slash maps, I see the file myactivity.html. Viewing this file, and then looking for the timestamp in question, we see a map search for directions. And so this is basically where the user requested directions to. Question three, I got three subscribers and counting. How many YouTube channels is the user subscribed to? 
Well, let's go to the folder YouTube and YouTube Music, and then Subscriptions, and then do an LS. There's only one file in here named subscriptions.json, and then let's go ahead and more this file, and it will give you the answer. Question four. Time flies when you're watching YouTube. What date was the first YouTube video the user watched uploaded? Let's use Firefox to go to the folder, YouTube and YouTube Music, and then History, and then view the file watchhistory.html. If we go back to the entry at the earliest watched video, you can click on it, which will bring you to YouTube and there will be your answer. Question five, who defines essential? What was searched on March 4th, 2021 at 4.09.35 a.m. Eastern Daylight Time? In Firefox, go to the folder, My Activity, and then search, and then view the file, myactivity.html. Going back to the entry for the time in question, and we can see the answer there. Question six. What is the price of the belt? Well, I gotta admit, when I saw this question, I had no idea what, what this is about. I thought I was missing another question somewhere. But then I realized, you know, maybe I should just go look at the activity. So basically in Firefox, I went to the folder, My Activity, and then Chrome, and then viewed the file, myactivity.html. Now I use the find feature within Firefox and look for the word belt. Once found, I clicked on the link to the shopping website where the price of the item uh, was listed. All right. So that brings us to the end of this video where we used only the Kane Linux Forensics Distro and the internet to find the answers for the Magnet Virtual Summit 2021 Capture the Flag contest, in particular the Google takeout portion. Keep in mind that there are probably many different ways to get the answers to these questions. This is only the way that I chose to do it, which may not be the fastest or the most elegant, but it works for me. Hope you enjoyed it, and if so, click on the thumbs up icon to like this video. Please hit the subscribe button to get notified when the next video comes out. Also, please leave me messages in the comment section below so I know what you liked and didn't like, or what you may want to see in future videos. See you next time.